Cuomo campaign says it won't debate the night of October 15th. The public deserves to see both candidates uh, on stage together at a time when they're going to be A, most engaged, and B, paying attention. The Christie campaign released this schedule yesterday. The first gubernatorial debate, October 8th, a lieutenant governor debate, the 11th, a second gubernatorial debate, October 15th, that's the night before, the booker Lonigan special election for U.S. Senate, and the Buono camp says the date it agreed to for a second debate was October 22nd. Political consultant Steve D'Amico, a Democrat who has negotiated the terms of many statewide debates, sees it as gamesmanship by the Christie camp. Well, I think the governor's trying to get this, this, these debates behind him as early as possible. Um, and I think he's also taking advantage, trying to take advantage of the confusion that he created by scheduling a second general election uh, here, unprecedented, uh, on October 16th. Do you think Chris Christie's trying to bury this debate in some way? You know, I'm not going to get into the uh, intentions or machinations of why the Christie campaign would like the debate on October 15th. The Christie campaign says it did not ask for a change in the date, that the 15th was proposed to it by debate sponsor Montclair State University. Sources say otherwise, one telling NJTV that the date was changed as a result of a phone call between Christie campaign chairman Bill Palatucci and Montclair State President Susan Cole. Palatucci said in a phone interview late this afternoon, not true. He called Dr. Cole, but to expedite negotiations, and he didn't even know what date had been selected. A spokesperson for Montclair State confirmed the phone call, but said the date was dictated by technical and scheduling considerations, not by Palatucci, who merely suggested the week of the 14th looks good. All of these debates should really be taking place after the special Senate election on October 16th, so that the voters aren't confused about what they're voting on. The Buono camp wants a new date or a new sponsor if Montclair State won't change the date. Our lawyers have sent a letter to ELEC requesting either a change of date or a change of venue if Montclair State won't be able to accommodate that. Um, we're waiting to hear back from ELEC. We're actually putting the cart before the horse here. At ELEC, the executive director says there is no debate calendar because Buono has not officially qualified for state matching funds yet, and he said any date change is up to the sponsor. By law, uh, it's the sp it's by law and by our regulations, it's the sponsors who have the final say in terms of uh, when the dates are uh, when the debates are going to be held. Jeff Brindle says ELEC is not even allowed to change debate sponsors at this point, something the Bono camp raised. So this imbroglio over when to hold a second gubernatorial debate remains unresolved. For NJ Today, I'm Michael Aaron in Trenton.